Investigators believe a man was under the influence during a deadly crash before Christmas. Good evening, everyone. I'm Steve Hensley. Leading our news tonight at 6, 26-year-old Jeffrey Mullins is charged with manslaughter after a crash that killed 76-year-old Marie Stiltner and seriously injured two others. He was in court this afternoon, and WIMT's Angela Sparkman was there. She has tonight's top story at 6. The first trooper who arrived at the wreck scene took the stand and testified that Mullins admitted he took pills before he drove. 10-638 Jeffrey Mullins. 26-year-old Jeffrey Mullins faces a list of charges, including manslaughter, DUI, and driving on a suspended license. State police say in the early afternoon hours on December 17th, Mullins was on the wrong side of the road on US 460 when he hit two cars. Mullins hit one car head-on with three women inside. 76-year-old Marie Stiltner died at the hospital. The other two women survived but are injured. Police say Mullins was also injured, and police made a discovery while at the hospital. I discovered a bag of uh, pills. They were like divided, like three pills divided in half. So there were actually six pieces in the bag. Investigators believe Mullins was under the influence at the time of the crash. He uh, indicated to Sergeant Justice that he'd actually been snorting pills prior to operating the vehicle that morning. Police testified Mullins took a blood test, but they are still waiting for the results. His attorney's request to reduce the manslaughter charge and his $100,000 bond were denied. The judge sent the case to the grand jury. And officials say more charges against Mullins are possible. In Pike County, I'm Angela Sparkman, WYMT 57 Mountain News.